Cookie dough packaging says do not consume raw cookie dough, but how many of us didn't listen? And we're still okay. So to understand why there's a warning, let's see what's growing on cookie dough. This testing process I'm showing is simple but effective at giving us an estimate of how much bacteria is on this cookie dough. All the equipment I use is sterile, so the bacteria you see is only from the cookie dough. Let's see what's growing. Now while this time lapse of bacteria is fun to watch, it doesn't help in providing an estimate of how much bacteria there is. Luckily, the third dilution helped me determine that there's about 10,000 bacteria per 10 grams of cookie dough. And this is where it gets interesting. There's a high chance that that bacteria, it won't even affect you. I know this because many cookie dough companies, like Nestle, have established many safety measures to prevent bad bacteria from getting into the cookie dough before it's even purchased. However, that's not 100% guaranteed. So why is this warning there? Eating raw cookie dough, it's a lot like driving without a seatbelt. You'll be fine most of the time, but it just takes that one time to really mess you up.